What's going on guys, Matt here, and today I'm going to be doing a video on something that I haven't done in like over a year, and that is Minecraft. Now, I got the idea from just, you know, sitting around and just thinking to myself what I could do to like make the channel a little bit better, and I know there's a lot of people who still like Minecraft, and um, basically when it became popular again for the first time in like a couple of years, so I decided to just play around with Minecraft, I recently got it on my PC. And I did some builds, and I'm going to be doing a Minecraft Ford F350. And I'm going to show you how to do it step by step. And if you guys are interested in building, this would be a really beneficial video. And let's get started. Okay, so the first things that you're going to need are all the blocks and stuff that you're going to need for your truck. So we're going to go all the way down. We're going to be using concrete, so we're going to need black concrete we're also going to need white concrete along with any color they want to make the truck i'm just going to make it um blue we're also going to need orange and red and one more color light gray so those are all the concrete stones that are concrete on blocks you're going to need for the truck you're also going to need glass, which doesn't really matter by the color. I'm just going to use white, which is basically pretty generic. You're also going to need stone. I'm going to show you why in a second. And then you're also going to need a bed because it gets dark really quickly in Minecraft. So obviously you're going to need a bed so you can get back to the light. And there you go. You got all your materials. And the only stuff you're going to need and you're not going to be able to go back to your inventory and get more stuff so this is basically all you need okay so the first step is going to be making your tires so what you're going to do is you're going to be doing one row of four one row of six all black and then you're going to do two black two gray Two black again. Same thing on the next row. Two black, two gray. Two black again. And then do one row of six, all with black again. And then you're going to be doing four. Just like that. So your wheel would look like that. It looks pretty basic. But I'm not going to try going into too much detail with the truck because I know all tires in the Ford F-350 model look pretty different. So I'm just going to go the basic route of it. And then you're going to do the same thing on the other side. This wheel is going to be in the inside of the truck. So if you really don't want to make the gray again, you don't have to. I'm choosing not to because it's going to be in the inside of the truck. So you're not really going to be able to see it anyway. So you're just going to keep going. And I don't know why it's building like extra blocks, even though I'm not pressing it like that. Probably because of the new update, because um, Minecraft did get a new update recently, and I'm starting trying to get used to it a little bit, but it's not really working out properly for me. So the wheel would look like that. It's pretty realistic, the length and the width of the, the wheel. So I think it looks pretty good. Now what you're going to do is you're going to go seven across, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then on that eighth one, that's when you're going to start your next set of wheels, just like that. And you're basically just going to do the same thing. So you're going to do row of four, and six, two more rows, well actually Three more rows. Oh my god, this PC is really not cooperating with me right now. I apologize. And boom, just like that. And then just do the same thing on the other side. Just build as you go. And then on the outside, that's when you're going to add the gray again. Just like that. And 
and just fill in as you go same as the inside part of the tire and there you go you have your two front wheels and then I'm going to go back here and show you what to do for the back set of wheels. Alright, so basically I'm just going to leave this bed here in case it gets dark so I don't have to keep making multiple beds during um, each part of the video. So what are you going to do for the back part or the back set of the wheels? This one's going to be a dually so it's going to be even more tires. I'm going to build four of these. So it is going to take a little bit of time. But anyways, you're going to go over 34 moving backwards starting from here so you're gonna go 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 so on the 34th block that's when you're gonna start your next tire and you're basically just going to build it going like that. And then for the dually, you're going to build two more rows over here. And then the basic set of wheels right there. And then you're basically just going to do the same thing on the other side. So you're going to go over seven, just like we did with the front. So four, five, six, seven, and then just... Do your next set, and then with the dually, do the next set of wheels, just like that. And then it's basically just the same thing. You're going to build a row of six, so if I can get a good angle. And this update is really not cooperating with me. So, two, row, uh, two blocks of black, and then gray, and then black again, just keep going. I know I'm just doing this over and over, but I want to make sure that I'm actually doing all the steps correctly, so that if you're following along, that you get this correct and accurate. And that's the only gray part that you need for the back set of the dually wheels. So basically, just build up from there, do the same thing here, and then just do the, uh, the uh, wheel on the other side. And then you're pretty much done with the wheels. And I'll show you what it looks like when I'm finished building it up. Okay, so after doing all that, this is what the back wheels should look like as a dually real life would look like two wheels there two wheels there and the front wheels like that and now we're going to get started with the exterior of the truck okay so now for the exterior what you're going to do first is go two blocks to the left of the sixth block from the wheel and you're going to build two blocks up with black concrete so it would look like that so you're going to do two concrete, um, three gray, and then you're going to do one gray, just like that. Actually, I did that wrong. Dang it. All right, so it would look like that, basically. One to the right. And then you're going to do two blue above it. And then you're going to do two more above it. Just like that. So basically what you're going to do is you're going to have one block above of each part of the wheel. It's kind of hard to word it, but that's kind of what you have to do and then you're going to go all the way across and just do the same thing going down make sure that it's one away from the wheel and then you're going to keep going and then you're going to make sure you're three blocks away from the ground 
So one, two, three, and then that fourth block is where you're going to end off with the blue. So just like that. All right, and you're going to add some other blocks to this. So you're going to put one more blue, and then you're just going to put two white. This is going to be for the lights for the front of the truck. And then what you're going to keep doing is you're just going to go all the way down to the right with the blue concrete. So you're basically just going to go all the way over. Sorry, it's kind of hard. Okay, so you're at the wheel. Now you're going to leave a little bit of space for the dually wheels since you are indeed going to be um, doing the same thing we did in the front, but except you're going to keep doing it on the back. So once again, make sure you are the you are from the fourth block from the ground. So that's where you're going to start off. Except you're going to start right here because we're going to continue with the method of staying one block away from the tire. And you're basically just going to do the same thing. You're just going to go one block away, just like that. Keep going from there. All right, that's not where I want to put it. I want to put it right there. And then I think that's where the last block is. Nope, one more. Okay. So that's where you're going to end off for the... Um... Oh, wait, actually, I got this wrong. My mistake. All right, that's a lot better. So it will look exactly like that. And then what you're going to do for the dually part is you're just going to go inside to connect with the truck. Just like that. And then it will look exactly like that. So it looks like a full dually just like that along with the rest of the lining of the truck so it'll look exactly like that and what you're going to do is do this on the other side as well so basically just do exactly the same with the the black the light gray the blue and just keep going all the way around so basically you're just going to do the same thing on the other side i was going to show you what to do specifically with the back but that file got corrupted for some reason i don't know why so basically, do the same thing on the other side, it looks exactly the same. And then for the back area, you're basically just going to do the same thing as you did with the front. You're going to go a couple blocks in, so starting from the outside of the dually, you're going to go three across, and then you're just going to build two blocks going to the left, and then you're just going to connect the back of the truck to the other side, and that's basically what you have for the connection to the back of the dually. Okay, so now we're gonna move on to the front of the truck. This is where you're gonna build like the license plate, the grill, everything. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your black concrete, you're gonna build in front, just like that, and then you're gonna build two full rows full of black concrete just like that and then you're going to build your second to go along with the other pieces of the black concrete shown right over here and then what you're going to do is you're going to build one row with the light gray concrete And then the next row is going to be a little bit tricky, but just follow my lead and you'll be okay. So you're going to do one black, 
block of concrete and then you're going to do one gray and then you're going to do three white oh wait I'm sorry made a mistake one black one gray one black and then you're going to do three white and then just do the same thing reverse do a black and then a gray and then one more black again just like that so that's where the license plate is going to be on the truck that's the location that I put for it and then what you're going to do for your next row is you're just going to build um, another gray so one more row of gray just like below and then you're going to build two white actually I made a mistake um, I apologize for the amount of mistakes I'm making because i um, trying to resemble a full Ford F-350 is not that easy so you gotta go back and tweak up the mess ups. So basically what you're going to do is you're going to build two blocks of white across just like that. Not on top of the gray, behind the gray. And you're just going to build four rows going up. So same thing over here, you already got two rows, three, and then four, just like that. And then you're going to do two blue on top of that. Just like that. Okay. And then starting from the third block, which is this one, you're going to do one gray, then five black, Oops. and then one gray again. So this is where the start of the grill is going to be taking place right in the middle over here and then you're going to do one full row of gray again and then again you're going to do one gray and then you're going to do one black this is where we're going to put the Ford logo and then you're going to do three blue blocks that's where the Ford logo is going to be placed on the truck right in front and then one black and then one gray and then you're going to do a full row of gray and then you're going to do one gray five black just like we did below and then one gray again so overall the front of the grill should look pretty symmetrical and build one more gray so the front of the truck should look like this okay so what we're gonna do next is we're gonna go back to the dually and then we're gonna put the little light where they usually put on the dually and we're gonna put that on the second block going in so we're gonna put one orange block and that's it basically the second block second row going inside same thing on the other side what the crap wrong spot um okay so let me start that again and then there we go and then what we're going to do next is we're going to go back to the front of the of the truck we're going to go to one of the sides over here we're just going to build a couple across and then when we get to that third row, we're going to go four blocks over. So we're going to go one, starting from there, two, three, four. And then from the fifth block to the seventh block, we're going to put three blocks with light gray concrete. And this is the little beds that they used to have for the power strokes, because that's the diesel company that Ford's used is the power stroke turbo diesel and that's the badge where they put it they put it on the front door 
around that area. Probably not 100% accurate of where the badge is actually placed, but this is around where they put it. At least it's in the front door. And then you're just going to basically do that on the other side as well. Okay, so now we're in the back of the truck. So what we're going to do is on the edge of the back. So we're going to build one more blue. So you have two stacks of blue. And then what you're going to do is you're going to grab your red. And this is where we're going to start building up the lights. So you're going to do three red. And then you're going to do one white and then one blue. So it, well, minus that. There we go. So it will look exactly like that. And then just do the same thing on the other side. So we do one blue, three red, one white, and then one more blue. So the back lights would basically look just like that. Okay, so what we're going to do next is we're going to be doing the door handles. So what we're going to do is we're going to start on the very first row of concrete. We're going to go over to the 11th block. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, And then what we're going to do is we're going to go to the 5th row. So we're going to build up a little bit. So we got 2, 3, 4, and then on that fifth one, we're going to do the door handle. We're going to put black concrete on there, and we're going to build two up, make it more of a lengthy door handle, and then we're going to put one more blue on top. So it looks exactly like that. And then for the uh, crew cab, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to go over nine. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. On the ninth block, we're going to do the same exact thing. We're going to go up four. Sorry about that. All right, and then we're going to do two black, and then one more blue, just like that. And then you're going to do the same exact thing on the other side of the truck. Okay, now that we got the door handles taken care of, this next step is going to be pretty simple. I'm really easy pretty much. So what you're going to do is you're going to grab one block of orange and then you're going to do one block of white and that's going to complete the front lights on the side. And then next up you're going to be doing the same thing on the other side. Orange and then white just like that. And then what you're going to do next is pretty much just complete the whole side of the truck you're just gonna fill it all in in blue basically so just keep going basically just start from here if you like start off with blue and literally just fill in the whole thing no changes no nothing just fill it all in with blue and you're gonna keep doing that even on the dually side you're gonna do that until you reach this row once you complete this row that's when you're gonna stop and that's when you're gonna complete the side um, paint of the side of the truck. It's kind of hard to word it. That's basically when you're just going to complete the side of the truck is all I'm trying to say. It's pretty simple. Just fill it all in blue and I'm going to show you what it looks like when I'm finished. Okay, now that we got the whole side of the truck done, this is what it should look like. All been covered in blue. And now this is an optional step that you guys might want to do. But what I usually do is I'm going to Take away one row of the dually. So let's stop like that. And then what you're going to do is just make a straight line to connect the two sides. And then you're just going to fill in the rest. Just like. Well, let me finish the other side and I'll show you. And then you're just going to finish it off like that so basically the dually would look like that instead which looks more realistic because the top part of the dually usually is shorter than the actual bed of the truck and so if you guys want to do that extra step to make it look a little more realistic then go right ahead if not you could just leave it the way it is just fill it in 
same way except with the extra layer of blue. So same thing, other side, take away the one layer from the dually, connect the two sides together just like that. And then just fill it in like we did on the other side and then I'm going to give you the next step in one second. Okay, now that we're done with the dually, the next step is going to take place here in the back. This is where we're going to make the, the tailgate door. So what we're going to do first is on the second row, which is the row I'm about to do right now, we're going to do three blue blocks and then three white and then three more blue and then that's where you're going to get your license plate just like that and then the next steps are pretty simple for the rest of the back door basically just build three more rows of blue going up And then when you reach the same row as the white light, this is where you're going to build the door handle for the back. So what you're going to do is you're going to do three blue. And then you're going to grab some black. You're going to do three black. And then grab the blue again and then just complete it with blue. And then the last row, just fill it in with blue to complete the top of the door. And that's what you're going to do for the back door. You got your door handle there. You got your license plate there. And that's how you do the back door. Okay, so the next step is going to be doing the windows for the truck. So what we're going to do is put one block of blue, one space to the left of the door handle. And then you're going to grab your glass. And then you're going to build seven across. Five, six, seven. And then you're going to grab your blue again. You're going to put two blocks of blue, just like that. And then you're going to grab your glass again. And then you're going to do eight glass. So five, six, seven, eight. And then what you're going to do is you're going to build three more rows of the same block on each row. So you're going to do the glass. And then do your blue. And just keep building your way up. And then finish it off with the blue. And that's how you're going to start off your windows for the truck. The next part is you're going to continue the glass for the window, but you're going to do it in a little bit of a different way. So what you're going to do is grab your glass again. And you're going to do it one less than the previous row. So we have eight blocks of glass on this row. This one you're going to do seven. And then we're going to do that again on the very next row so that you're going to have six. And then you end off just like that. For the back, it's going to be completely same. So what we're going to do is just complete it. Same amount of blocks, which is seven for the crew side of the of the truck and then just do the same thing just fill it all in blue just like that and then it should look like that and now you're going to complete it by topping it off with a layer of blue to start off the roof so basically just keep building up and then you're going to put one piece of blue on top of each piece of glass and then you're going to put one blue here and then you are going to do three blocks of black concrete just like that that is going to be for your towing mirrors and that's going to be one of the last steps that i'm going to show you but for the black you're just going to leave it like that and then what you're going to do is just do it all the same on the other side do exactly what i told you for this and do it on the other side over here and i'll show you what it looks like when it's finished Okay, so when you're finished with the glass for the side of the truck, this is what it should look like. Completely same, symmetrical. 
And then the next step is we're going to do the windows for the very back of the truck. So what we're going to do is on the same row as you put that long row of blue concrete, or if it's easier, just go one to the left of the door handle. That's when we're going to make the back part of the truck. We're just going to build blue across. And then we're just going to build up to its point, which is going to be the same as the side of the truck to make it look obviously symmetrical. Just keep building it up. And then that would be the last row for blue. And then for the windows, what you're going to do is you're going to, you could be a little creative with this, but if you don't, you can just build the whole thing with glass, but I'm going to kind of break it down a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a row of two, a row of three, and then another row of two, because that's usually the divider of the glass on most trucks. Looks pretty nice. So basically we're just going to do the same thing probably mumbled those bits of words but you kind of get what I'm trying to say just build up until you reach the same point as the side of the truck get that extra piece of glass out of the way build one more layer and then then it will look like that and then you're pretty much good for the back side and basically just build up the blue. It'll be easier if you just like, just build it up going like that. And then just build across just like that. And there is another way that you want to be creative with this. So this is where like the back lights come in. Because like, usually if it's really dark outside, if you look at the back of a truck, there's usually white and red lights on the very top of the roof. So what you're going to do is break these two apart where it meets with the blue. And you're going to put two white, both on each end. And then you're going to do three red. Just like that. And then it would look like a generic truck with the back lights. Okay, the next step is you're going to build the glass now for the front of the truck. So what we're going to do to start off is we're going to start with the very top of the row of the truck. And we're just going to build one row of blue going across. Just like, just like that. And then what you're going to do is you're going to get your glass. And then you're pretty much going to do the same thing as you did with the blue. So you're just going to build across. And you're going to do that for three layers. So I already did one. This one is going to be two. And then number three. So it should look like this. The next step is we're going to build the hood of the Ford F-350. So what we're going to do is we're going to need blue and black for the hood. So what we're going to do is we're going to do one blue. And then we're going to do three black. Mistake right there. So one blue, three black. This is where the Ford F-350 uh, symbol would be placed. And then you're just going to fill in the rest with blue if this game would actually cooperate with me. So it would look just like that. And then we're gonna build the next row. So we're gonna do just like that and go one more over than the black for the next row. So it look exactly like that. And then what we're gonna do next is you're gonna go one more row inside and we're gonna follow exactly the same layers as the front. Or the side, rather, I mean. 
So then we're going to do it just like that. It's a lot of steps to the hood. It's kind of complicated, but it will work in the end. And then what you're going to do next is you're going to do one row of blue, just that one block. And then you're going to put one right there, just like that. So on the side, it would look exactly like that. And once you're done with that, you're going to go on the other side. You're going to do the same thing, which is one blue, three black. And then just complete the row. And then for the next row, same thing. Go one more than the blue. Uh, I mean the black, rather. Man, my wording is really off today. I apologize. And then just one more of blue, just like that. And then same thing, just build up the blue. Building a lot more than I want right now, just like that. And for the next step, you're gonna build the middle part of the hood. So basically you're gonna build it up. And then once the sec once this row starts to go up one layer, you're going to do the same exact thing with the middle. It's kind of hard to word it, but it's easier to do than say. And then you're going to finish it just like that. And basically just do it for the rest of the hood. So, second row. And then just finish it like that. And just keep following it. Use it as a guide. And just continue with it. Alright, so top of the hood should look exactly like that and what you're gonna do next is one of the very last steps this isn't the last step it's one of it's one of the last steps for the truck so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to the back and this is where you're gonna make the flatbed so what you're gonna do is pretty difficult this is probably one of the hardest steps for the truck because you have to build the walls around the wheels which is a pretty difficult step, but I think we can manage to do it. It's going to be pretty simple. So what we're going to do is we're going to stay, like I said, one block away from the tire. And so we're going to go like that. And then same thing here, just stay one away. Just like that. I believe it's the same. Yep, just like that. And then you're going to kind of build your way around the tire. The same as we did in the very beginning of the video, which was making the exterior of the truck. We're going to do the same thing with the inside of the bed. So basically, just build it around. And then just do the same thing on the other side. I actually went too high on this one. There we go. Just like that. And so the results will look like that. And what you're going to do is basically just build it up. And then you just keep doing that until you reach the maximum height of the bed. So one step at a time, just build up just like that. Go, uh, sorry, move on to this row. And then just, like I said, go one step at a time. And just keep building up until you've reached the maximum height of the bed. So it would look like that. Or if you want to be more sophisticated, you would just take away some of this stuff. So you would take away this row. You would take away this row. And then you would take away whatever is left of the of the lining of the bed 
and then you would just build basically across to that side of the truck. If it was too dark for you to see it, I apologize. Um, if you want, I could just say it over again. Basically, just take away the most you can out of this um, lining for the wheels as much as possible until it looks like this. And then basically what you would do is just build it up. And so it would look like that. And then this is kind of a hard step because it takes so much out of the um, out of the truck, and it just it's a pretty difficult step because of how many like corners you have to go into and all that. So basically, just follow the what do you call the lining, and then you'll basically just be just fine. It's really hard to word because I'm basically just doing this right on the spot. I don't have like a script or anything for this video, so if I mumble a little bit or or if you um, think I'm talking weird, then then I apologize because this, this is really not easy for me, just doing it right on the spot. And then you would just build it up just like that, and then that this part would actually have to be completed too. And then get in as tight as you can and just complete that last part. It's pretty difficult. And then there you go. And then what you would do is is back up and then just complete the rest of the door. Or I mean the the lining rather. All right, I can't really build there because there's a bat in my way. All the animals that they have in this game is really beyond me. But um, anyways, really getting off topic here. But basically, just build as you go. You would have that little lineage in the part of the uh, truck. As I am attempting to kill that bat as he finally flies away out of my sight reducing the distraction and then basically just do the same on the other side I'm not gonna film myself doing it because it's gonna make the law uh, the video like twice as long and I'll let you guys do the other side and I'll get back in a second okay so now that you got your other side and lining finished it does take a little bit but it looks pretty good to me and so what you're going to do next is kind of a simple step. You are going to close off the tires by going across the tire. For this one, you don't have to stay one away from the tire since the back tire isn't necessarily going to be turning. So what you're going to do is basically just build up as you go and stay along the lines of the liner. So then you're going to start from there, keep going, follow your lead. And make it just like that. So I'm going to do the other side as well. I know it's a really long video for this, and it's really really overwhelming kind of but um the result of this looks really good so far and that's what the result looks like for the full liner of the tires and now what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your stone that's where the stone comes in and this is what you're gonna make for your flatbed now I don't really know what other block to use for this so Whatever block you want to use is up to you. I'm just going to use stone. If you don't want to, then you may use another block of your choice. But um, I'm just going to continue with the stone. And you're going to build starting from the very first row of the blue. And just build 
the whole entire flatbed with the block that you choose. And basically just keep going and then just keep going until you reach the end over here. Okay, now that we got the stone as the uh, flatbed, we are now going to go to the front of the truck. This is the second to last step. And they are both really simple. So what we're going to do is we're going to be doing the towing mirrors now. So what we're going to do is we're going to be doing one black concrete on the first one and then one on the third. And then what we're going to do is we're going to make a second row over here and we're going to build three back just like that. And we're going to do four going up. So that's the fourth. And then this we're going to put the mirror. So we're going to do one, two, finish it off with one black piece of concrete on top. And then just do the same thing as you complete it just like that. And now when you go on the other side, you're going to do it at a little bit of a different approach. This one we're going to add some orange to it, which is going to be where the light for the turn signal is. Basically, it's kind of hard to explain, but usually um, heavy-duty trucks such as, the, as such as the Ram, the Ford, and all the other ones, they usually have mirrors like this. And you guys know what I'm talking about. So basically, you're going to build two orange on the very last row and then you're going to put black and basically what you're going to do is just finish it with black except for the except for this row over here because that's just the um, two ends connecting the mirror to the truck and then you're going to basically do that on the exact same way on the other side of the truck I'll show you because it's basically doing it a, a little bit reverse so I'll do it again, one and one, and then you're going to do four, grab your glass, just like that, and then it looks just like that. Now on the front side, two orange, one black, and then the rest of it is just black concrete, and then it will look like that. So this is what the front of the truck will look like, and then this is pretty much optional, this very last step, but this is something that I like to include to make the truck look a little bit nicer. And what you would do is you would put one orange here, one orange there, 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 and there. So basically you would just keep alternating as you go. You go every other one, you would put an orange uh, roof light, and then it would look like that. And then basically this is also the last step. I know I keep saying it's the last step, but... um. Sometimes I just have things slip my mind. It's basically just the roof. It's really the easiest step. Just literally fill in the last row with blue. And other than that, that is basically it. The truck looks very nice. I think the result came out very good. And even though this did take a while, I think it was worth the time because of um, how... Pretty much accurate it came out. I know it's not 100% perfect, but I believe it came out what I wanted it to be. It looks like a real Ford F350 dually. Now, what year would this be? I'd say probably 2005, maybe. I'm not that good with Fords and all that, but um, in my opinion, this would look like a 2005 Ford. If you guys don't know what a 2005 Ford F350 looks like with the dually, then look it up online. I really think that this looks really, really similar to it. And we are officially finished. Now, I didn't do the inside. I wasn't really meant to do it. I just wanted to do the exterior, show you what it looked like. And I really love the results of 
how the Ford F-350 came out. Looks beautiful, looks amazing. And this is one of the best builds I've ever had on Minecraft. I really like the result of it. And overall, it's a really great build. I'm really happy with it. And if you guys really did make it to the end, I really appreciate you guys watching. This is a really fun video to make. It took a lot of time. But if you guys made this on your own or followed along with me and it came out great, please let me know down in the comments below. And if there's any other build that you want me to do, put it down in the comments as well. Don't forget to drop a like on the video. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and turn on the post notification bell for more videos. I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Wish you all a Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, whatever holiday you celebrate. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace. Love. Coming down like a copter, Michael Murray on looking like a shotter. Louis Carry on feeling like a ganja. Keep a very long shotty for imposters.